What up guys, coming at you guys with another video, Mikey Garcia versus Errol the True Spence Jr. Much anticipated hype fight, and Errol did his thing. Um, I was going for Mikey, honestly. I fuck with Mikey heavy, and shout out to Mikey, because he's, he's the only one with the balls to move up to welterweight. Another, none of the welterweights are doing it. Apparently Pacquiao wants that smoke, but uh, shit, I'll just have to wait and see. Maybe he does want it. I don't know. That's a PPB fight, for sure. I, I would buy it and watch it. Much like I did with this fight. But Mike, Mikey Garcia did his thing. He didn't get stopped. A lot of people were saying he was going to get stopped. Nonetheless, he did lose the fight. But it was expected. We all knew Errol Spence was going to be the... He has the height, the reach, and the weight advantage. Mikey Garcia, he, he was getting tagged. Some shots were landed somewhere. But he wasn't really responding back. Uh, Errol Spence was really using his reach. He was jab. He, his jab was perfect tonight. Uh, during the second half of the fight, he was going to the body a lot. Um, it looked like he possibly got, could have got a KO, but he didn't. Uh, Mikey Garcia survived, and and still, um, shit. I would look. You know, these welterweights need to step up. But you know. Errol Spence, fuck it, man. You go up. You move up uh, 13 pounds. You fight fucking the winner of uh, Canelo uh, Jacobs. Fuck it. Let's see it, Errol Spence. Or fucking move up to 154. Fight uh, Jared Hurd or Mungia. Let's see that. Come on, Spence. Not playing. I'm not going to be one of those fans. <laughs> probably you guys are are probably like, ah, oh, damn, this dude's serious. But her, but nah, I'm just playing. Errol Spence is a different type of monster. Um, at his division right now, the champs, Keith Thurman, good fight. Pacquiao, good fight. Uh, Crawford, good fight. Sean Porter, good fight. Uh, unification, man, we need to see those unifications. Uh, Thurman, Pacquiao, Porter could easily be done. Crawford, uh, you know, that's going to be hard to work out, but who knows? Maybe, you know, it might happen. But the other three, definitely easy fights to be made. I don't see why, you know, the fights wouldn't really be made. But, you know, like I said, shout out to Garcia, man. He did his thing. He moved up. Definitely should be. I mean, he has the skills, but I don't know. Like, all the top welterweights, you know, I think, you know, he takes a L. Just because, you know, he's. it's not easy to, from 126 moving up to welterweight, you feel me? Pacquiao, you know, he's special. Floyd Mayweather moved up from 130. Uh, you know, these these are special type of fighters. You know, Juan Manuel Marquez, you know. It's, but Mikey, you know, he... Or maybe, I don't know. He should have took, like, an easier fight. But, like, you know, Mikey... Shout out to Mikey uh, for wanting these tough fights. He could have easily taken shit, like... Just to test the waters, like, you know, just be on the undercard, fucking fight a, a Samuel Vargas, fight a fucking, Adrian Granados is my boy, but, like, someone like Renato's, you know, a Sam Eggington, you know, someone, you know, that could be beat, a Bundu, you know, but, hey, man, nonetheless, it is what it is. Shout out to Errol Spence. The truth. He is the motherfucking truth.